Hi for everyone that's joining me right now. How you doing? This is the uh, HTC Incredible running uh, the MIUI system or the MyUI. Um, this is basically how it looks. It looks a lot like iOS 4. Um, even the little icons have like the little I iOS 4 and the folders sort of look like the iOS 4. So this, if you really like the iPhone or the iPod Touch, you will really like MIUI, but this this is just a really really cool uh, ROM for the HTC Incredible. Um, it's got it's got a nice little notification bar up here. You you could uh, turn on a whole bunch of different things through the notification bar up here. Um, editing mode sort of works that way too. Um, if you go to a blank screen, you hold down this button. You can actually get your widgets through going through up here. Uh, these are all your widgets, and you would scroll through your widgets like this. And if you found one you'd like, you could just take it and then drop it down. Um, onto the onto the home screen that you would want. I haven't had any issues with this particular ROM at all. I haven't had force quits. In fact, the battery life is phenomenal. This, little, if you see this, I'm a little bit over halfway. I've been running it all day, um, all day long, and it's lasted me an entire day, which is pretty incredible for this phone because the incredible kind of sucks on battery life. Um, so yes, this is the ROM. It's very fast, very bug free from what I noticed. I really, really enjoy it. Um, to get it, it's really easy as well. If, you er if your phone's already rooted and you're used to flashing ROMs, then you could just get ROM Manager. You're probably familiar with ROM Manager, but if you haven't, and you, you can just go to Unrevoked, get the one-click rooting for it, just follow the instructions on, on Unrevoked, you download ROM Manager from Android Market, and then you just go here and you want to go to Download ROM. And in the Download ROMs, you can actually find MIUI, port it over by NIX, and you can go click on it, download it, um, prior to doing this, you just want to make sure you back it up just in case you have any problems. You can always flash it. Um, if you do have any problems, the first time I installed it, it just kept rebooting and I thought I'd brick my phone because I'm an idiot and I didn't really know how to do any of this rooting stuff. Uh, I just had to go back and uh, restore my old operating system. And when you install the, the ROM on here, you have to make sure that you clear the data and cache prior to doing that because it'll give you an endless boot cycle when you install this on here. Um, it's a really, really fast ROM. I really enjoy, uh, really enjoy it. Um, I haven't, like I said, had any problems with it. Uh, so if you are looking for a nice ROM, you, you like the iPhone, and you like the features of the iPhone, then you're going to really, really enjoy getting this ROM for, for this phone because it, it really is something special. In fact, when I put it on there, I was like, oh my goodness, I'm, I finally really enjoy this phone. MIUI, and this is this is what you're running. And like I said, it's a very slick, very uh, fast operating system. Uh, this ROM I have not had any problems with. The camcorder works, the camera works, the wireless works, the GPS works. Um, there are some older things in it. The Android market actually is not up to date. So if you go in here and you notice the Android, if you want to use the Android market, um, it is not up to date yet. It's still the old style of the Android market where it's all boxed off. It doesn't have that new green little thing in there. But you can always download that, and I'm thinking about downloading it as well. And the cool thing about this, and if you like to hack your phones or you know anything about it, and you like keyboards like, say for instance, you like the swipe keyboard, uh, the swipe keyboard actually works on this UI, and that's really something that I enjoyed. This is awesome. And... I really liked Swipe on the Incredible. You can get that now. If you can go to Swipe, just go to the uh, Google, type in Swipe for Android. Uh, say you want to beta test it, and right now you can ba download the beta for it, and it's out now. And, you know, even if you don't, if you like the custom keyboard, the one that, that comes with it, um, the cool thing about this is the keyboard that comes with this is actually the gingerbread keyboard. So they give you the new keyboard in the uh, UI, which is really, really nice compared to the uh, the old keyboard for Android. So this, you know, it's just a really good thing. I would give it a try, and if you have any problems, just let me know. Just give me a post, and I, I could actually walk you through it. But make sure if you do decide you are going to root your phone, when you root your phone, before you put any ROM on your phone, you want to make sure you back it up. Um, always back it up. And to know for sure if you back it up, it's going to boot into that it's going to boot into the H boot mode and you'll actually see it backing up. It actually takes about 10 minutes to load the ROM and actually takes some time too, so don't freak out. Um, 
everything should work out fine. It's actually fairly simple to root your phone in to load custom ROMs on it, but the main thing you have to remember is to back up your main uh, UI, your main ROM, when you before you put anything on it. And like I said, it's really fast. If you really like it, I would recommend it. The, the animations are cool, the style of everything is cool, everything works, you'll really like it, the text messaging works, you, it basically, like I said, works just like the iOS, and you even get the little notifications down here, when you get a phone call, you get the little red dot with the one, and same thing with the text messages. Um, I haven't experienced that with the email yet, I have not experienced uh, getting those little bubbles when I have uh, emails on here, but what, what are you going to do? I mean, it's not super perfect yet, but they're still working out the bugs, it still is in beta, so... Go ahead, get in there and uh, check out MIUI and really enjoy it because it's, it's really cool.